Oppo Find X2 Pro smartphone was launched in March 2020. It comes with 6.7 inches AMOLED 120Hz punch hole display with 90.9% screen to body ratio and aspect ratio 20 by 9. It is protected by Corning Gorilla Glass 6 on front as well as aluminum or leather frame body on the back side of the smartphone. It also certified with IPv6 shade dust water resistant technology up to 1.5 meter in depth of water for 30 minutes. It has optical under display fingerprint sensor with an image density of 513 ppi. Find X2 Pro smartphone is based on 1.8 to 2.8 GHz octa core Snapdragon 865 7nm Plus processor with Adreno 650 GPU and packed with 12 GB of RAM. According to Qualcomm, the Adreno 650 GPU offers a 25% improved performance. Adreno 650 having 50% more compute units than the Adreno 640. Furthermore, the clock speed of the pixel shaded was also increased by 50% to achieve the high gaming and browsing performance. Find X2 Pro smartphone has triple camera setup on the rear that consists of 25mm wide 48MP main shooter with 1.7 aperture and 1.12 micron pixel size. Main camera provides the feature of omnidirectional PDAF laser autofocus, optical image stabilization 4K and slow motion video recording. The slow motion sensor records video at the rate of 960 frames per second in ultra HD resolutions. And the second one is 129mm wide 13MP periscope telephoto lens with 3.0 aperture having a feature of PDF laser autofocus, optical image stabilization and 5x optical zooming capacity. The third one is 17mm 48MP ultra wide sensor with 2.2 aperture and 0.8 micron pixel size. On the front the smartphone has 32MP punch hole wide camera with 2.4 aperture. It runs Color OS 7.1 based on Android 10 and packed with 256GB of inbuilt storage with no SD card support. Oppo Find X Pro smartphone is powered by 4260mAh battery with 60W of fast battery charging that can be charged 100% just in 38 to 40 minutes, which is fastest charging speed for any smartphone. OnePlus 8 Pro smartphone was launched in April 2020. The smartphone has 6.78 inches gorgeous 120Hz fluid AMOLED QHD Plus punch hole display with 90.8% screen to body ratio and aspect ratio 19.5 by 9. OnePlus 8 Pro's fluid engine ensures on screen contents flow seamlessly from one frame to the next while innovating MEMC technology provides even smoother motion. With a display that can reach an incredible 1300 nits so you can see on screen content even under direct sunlight. OnePlus 8 Pro smartphone has protection of Corning Gorilla Glass on front as well as on the back side of the smartphone with aluminum frame body. It is certified with IP6 dust water resistant technology that can bear 1.3 meter depth in water for 30 minutes. It has optical in-display fingerprint sensor with an image density of 513 ppi. OnePlus 8 Pro smartphone based on octa core Qualcomm Snapdragon 865 7nm Plus processor with Adreno 650 GPU and packed with 8 and 12 GB of RAM. Snapdragon 865 7nm Plus is 25% more powerful setting a new benchmark for performance. State-of-the-art LPDDR5 RAM drastically improves operating speed 30% with a consumption of 20% less power. Experiences up to 125% higher write speed with an improvement of 3.05 management system. The most advanced feature of OnePlus 8 Pro is to switch automatically between 5G and non-5G networks and extending your battery life so you can stay connected for longer. OnePlus 8 Pro smartphone has quad camera setup on the rear, which consists of 25mm and 119-degree 48MP main shooter with 1.8 aperture having a feature of omnidirectional PDAF and laser autofocus. The main camera expands your perspective with a dramatic 120-degree field of view and let you to frame everything from epic group photos to nighttime cityscape with a brand new 48MP ultra-wide angle camera. The main camera allows to take your pet photos to the next level with smart pet capture. Software algorithms work behind the scene to identify pets and auto-adjust camera settings for the perfect snap. On the video side, the main camera can record video up to 4K at the rate of 60 frames per second. There is also a sign mode which crops your 4K at the rate of 30 frames per second and 60 frames per second video to a 21 by 9 aspect ratio. Super stabilization is only supported up to 4K at the rate of 30 frames per second but optical image stabilization still works. And the second one is 8MP 2.4 aperture telephoto lens with PDAF and 3x optical zoom. 
and third one is 14 mm and 116 degree 48 megapixel ultra wide sensor with 2.2 aperture and 0.8 micron pixel size. The fourth one is 5 megapixel dedicated macro camera with 2.4 aperture. The macro mode brings you closer and focus on subjects just 3 cm away to capture more details. On the front, the smartphone has 16 megapixel punch hole selfie camera with 2.0 aperture. The front camera can record video at the rate of 30 frames per second in 1080 resolutions. OnePlus 8 Pro smartphone operates on Oxygen OS 10.0 based on Android 10 and packed with 128 and 256 GB of inbuilt storage with no SD card support. OnePlus 8 Pro smartphone is compiled with massive 4510 mAh battery with 30 w of fast battery charging as well as warp charge that can be charged 50% in 23 minutes. It also supports 30 w of fast wireless charging and 3 w of reversible wireless charge. Xiaomi Mi 10 Pro 5G smartphone was launched on February 2020. The front of the smartphone is dominated by a curved 6.67 inches Super AMOLED 90Hz refresh rate punch hole display with 89.8% screen to body ratio and aspect ratio 19.5 by 9. This smartphone has a protection of Corning Gorilla Glass 5 on front as well as on the back with aluminum frame body. It has optical in-display fingerprint sensor with an image density of 386 ppi. Mi 10 Pro 5G smartphone is powered by 1.86 GHz Silver Octa-Core Snapdragon 865-700mm processor which operates on 2.84 GHz CPU frequency with Adreno 650 GPU and packed with 8 and 12 GB of RAM. The Snapdragon 865 5G is an ultimate intelligent mobile platform that will extend the way people see. The new Qualcomm Spectra 480 ISP captures professional quality videos at gigapixel speeds while simultaneously taking brilliant 64 megapixel photos. The brand new Qualcomm Snapdragon Elite Gaming features brings desktop level gaming to mobile with ultra realistic graphics. Mi 10 Pro 5G smartphone has quad camera setup on the rear, which consists of 25mm wide 108 megapixel main shooter with 1.7 aperture. The main camera providing excellent photography features such as portrait mode, background blurring, pro mode, photo timer, leveling, documents mode, brush mode, and face recognition. On the video side, the main camera provides feature of micro slow motion video 8K recording at the rate of 30 frames per second and 4K recording at the rate of 30 by 60 frames per second. It also records slow motion video at the rate of 960 frames per second in 720 by 1080 resolutions. And the second one is 50mm 12 megapixel telephoto lens with 2.2 aperture with dual pixel PDAF and 2x optical zoom. And third one is also 8 megapixel telephoto lens with 2.0 aperture which provides feature of dual pixel PDF, 5x hybrid and 3x optical zoom. And fourth one is 13mm and 117-degree 20MP ultra-wide sensor with 2.2 aperture and 1.02 micron pixel size. The ultra-wide angle can really struggle in the dark with both exposure and autofocus. On the front, the smartphone has ultra-clear 20MP punch hole camera with 2.0 aperture and 0.8 micron pixel size. Camera record video at the rate of 30 by 120 frames per second in 720 and 30 frames per second in 1080 resolutions. Mi 10 Pro 5G smartphone operates on Mi UI 11 based on Android 10 and packed with 256 and 512GB of inbuilt storage with no SD card support. Mi 10 Pro 5G smartphone compiled with 4500 mAh battery with 50W of fast battery charging. It also supports 30W wireless and 5W of reversible charge. Huawei P40 Pro smartphone was launched on April 2020. The smartphone has 6.58 inches OLED 90Hz punch hole display with 91.6% screen to body ratio and aspect ratio of 20 by 9. It is protected by Corning Gorilla Glass on front and also sports 3D card glass which saves the device from scratches or minor accident falls. P40 Pro smartphone is certified with IP6 dust water resistant technology that can be survived up to 1.5 meter depth in water for 30 minutes. It has optical under display fingerprint sensor with an image density of 441 ppi. P40 Pro smartphone is based on 2.3 to 2.8 GHz high silicon grade 9905 G7 nm plus processor with Mali G76 MP16 GPU and packed with 8 GB of RAM. The ARM Mali G76 MP16 is an integrated high-end graphics card for ARM based system. 
It was introduced early 2019 in the Kari 905G and according to Huawei, it should be about 6% faster and 20% more efficient than Adreno 640 in Snapdragon 855 processor. It integrates 16 of the 20 possible cores and is based on second generation of the Bifrost architecture. P40 Pro smartphone has quad camera setup on the rear that consists of 23mm wide 50 megapixel ultra vision main sensor with 1.9 aperture and 0.8 micron pixel size. P40 Pro smartphone has 45% better color precision and is capable of accurate analysis and segmentation of environments and peoples. It restored the original look with great lighting, natural color and sharp details. Huawei Ultra Vision sensor even in the dark, fancy dress and stunning night skylight can be captured with great lightning, sharp color and low noise. And the second one is 125mm 12MP periscope telephoto lens with 3.4 percent and 5x optical zoom. It also provides a feature of 10x hybrid zoom and 50x maximum zoom. And the third one is 18mm 40MP ultra wide sensor with 1.8 aperture that provides a feature of ultra low light, slow motion video, telephoto video and 4K time lapse video in full HD resolutions. Finally, P40 Pro smartphone has cinematic video camera with multiple features. And the fourth one is 3D depth sensor for real-time depth detection and bokeh mode. On the front, the smartphone has dual punch hole camera system consists of 32 megapixel main camera along with time of flight 3D depth sensor. The new set of upgraded high definition 32 megapixel front camera with autofocus and IR depth sensor. The intelligent optimization on lighting, skin color and texture detail is more accurate and personal to make you love taking selfies. P40 Pro smartphone operates on EMUI 10 based on Android 10 and packed with 128, 256 and 512GB of inbuilt storage. That is expandable by Nano SD card up to 256GB uses shared SIM slot. This smartphone is powered by 4200mAh battery with 40W of fast battery charging. It also supports 27W fast wireless charging as well as 27W fast reversible wireless charging. Galaxy S20 Ultra is a decent phone and display is clearly its standard feature. The Galaxy S20 Ultra 5G smartphone was launched in February 2020. The smartphone has 6.9 inches dynamic AMOLED 2 hex punch hole display with 89.9% screen to body ratio and aspect ratio of 20 by 9. It also supports 120Hz FHD and 60Hz QHD smooth display. High refresh rates makes animation and scrolling look much smoother and can also help with compatible games. It has under display ultrasonic fingerprint sensor with an image density of 511 ppi. S20 Ultra is protected by Corning Gorilla Glass 6 on front as well as on the back side of the smartphone with aluminum frame body. It is also certified with IP6 test dust water resistant up to 1.5 meter in depth of water for 30 minutes. The smartphone is based on Exynos 907nm plus chipset and 2.0 to 2.7 GHz octa-core Qualcomm Snapdragon 865 7nm plus processor and packed with 12 and 16 GB of RAM. The Snapdragon 865 CPU and 12GB of RAM inside the S20 Ultra make it very snappy. The Galaxy S20 Ultra smartphone has quad camera setup on the rear. Galaxy S20 Ultra camera system has a lot going for it, including a 108MP sensor that captures high detail images, a 10x lock lens zoom and up to 100x digital space zoom. The main camera also provides optical image stabilization, face detection, autofocus but Galaxy S20 Ultra was definitely slower to focus than the iPhone 11 Pro Max. The Samsung phone focus was jumpy while the iPhone focus was practically instant and smooth. The main camera also provides the feature of 4K, 8K and slow motion video recording in HD and HD plus resolutions. On Galaxy S20 and S20 Plus, users can record approximately 1 second of video captured at the rate of 960 frames per second with approximately 32 seconds of playback. On the other hand, Galaxy S20 Ultra users can record approximately 1 second of video captured at the rate of 480 frames per second and digitally enhance the video at the rate of 960 frames per second with approximately 32 seconds of playback. The second one is 103mm 48MP periscope telephoto lens with 3.5 aperture and 10x hybrid optical zoom. The third one is 13mm 12MP ultrawide sensor with 2.2 aperture which provides feature of super steady slow motion video recording. And the fourth one is time of flight 3D depth sensor with 1.0 aperture. 
On the front, the smartphone has 26mm wide 40 megapixel punch hole selfie camera with 2.2 aperture. It runs on one UI 2 based on Android 10.0 and packed with 128, 256, and 512GB of inbuilt storage with SDXC card that uses shared SIM slot. S20 Ultra 5G smartphone is powered by a 5000mAh battery with 45W of fast battery charging. It also has 15W of fast wireless and 9W of reverse wireless charging support.